can sing and dance and we don't need pants See, we're just like you We've got regular jobs just with low going off See, we're just like you Yes, we graduate from Harvard Like ahead of my class But if they just sobriety I run that press There's no strings attached and there's no head of mine There are 3.2 million puppets, or as we prefer to be called, fabricated Americans, currently residing in the United States. And despite all of our many accomplishments, most people would still rather shammy their car with us than have us date their daughters. But, you know, I don't let it get me down. Hey, after all, you know, some of my best friends are humans. Hey, Greg. Hey, Jimbo. What are you doing home from work? Dude, I hate being a pool man. It's not like in the movies at all. What, no horny housewives? <laughs> no, all they want me to do is clean their pools. Yeah, well, at least you have a job. It is impossible for a puppet to find work out there. Well, they're hiring at the arcade. Yeah, $1.15 an hour to be whack-a-mole? I don't think so. You should see the guy I'd be replacing. He talks like Muhammad Ali. <laughs> Why can't you just get me a job over at uh, Sweet Knuckle Junction? Don't start, Greg, all right? I'm not calling my dad. Oh, come on, Jim. <laughs> I'm not calling him. Well, fine, then I'm not gonna stop doing this. Jimmy, 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 Jimmy. It's not gonna work, Jimmy, Greg. Jimmy, 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 Jim, 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 Jimmy, 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 Jimmy. Stop! Jimmy, I'm Jimmy. calling him. <laughs> Hello. Hey, Dad. Hey, son. What big award did you win today? And you know I kid out of disappointment. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I know you're busy and have a lot of insults to cram into one short phone call, so I'll get to the point. Do you have any openings for an assistant or something? Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, 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 Jimmy! Oh, this is great, son! I'm so glad to hear you're finally taking some initiative. Oh, I knew you had it in you. Knew you would grow up sooner or later. Whoa, 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 it's not for me, it's for a friend of mine. I knew you would never grow up. What the hell was I thinking? Hey there, Gil. Not now. You the man. Son, what kind of future do you think you have as a pool boy? I'm a pool man. Hi. All right, send your friend in, I'll see what I can do. But Jimmy, I'm really worried about your son. You know, I just read this article about children of highly successful fathers, and these kids, they sabotage their own futures because they can't compete with their father's, you know, brilliant accomplishments. You babysit actors on some lame kitty show. I'm a director. And by the way, you put too much chlorine in the pool and turned your mother's hair green. Okay, here we go, people. Places, roll cameras. Static electricity sketch, take one. And action. Well, hello there, Professor Ape. What you doing with those balloons? Just a little experiment with static electricity, Dotty. Static electricity, blah. You can count on my interest. <laughs> <laughs> Just watch as I rub these balloons on my fur, rubby dub dub, and ta da. Can static electricity be used to <sighs> line? Oh, please Cut. Again. What? What? The uh, the line, Rochester, is can static electricity be used? to light up a Christmas tree. Yeah, well, the only thing that's lit up is Warren. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> laugh it up, Rachi. I may not be able to remember the drive over here, but at least I can get my lines right. Ooh. Guys, guys, can we just try and get this right because the new boss from the network is here? Where'd you come from? PBS. It looks more like PMS. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's go. Roll cameras. Static electricity sketch, take two. Action! Can static electricity be used to light up a Christmas man? Christmas girl? Take 11. Can addicts miss atrocity? B. Cut. Yes. Take 17. Action! <clears throat> Are we rolling? Take. Uh, who the hell cares? Can static electricity be used to light up my. Oh, sh sorry. Cut! That, that's, uh. that's a cut. Cut. Damn it, Rochester. Learn your lines. Oh, don't blame me, Jack. Your timing's all off. I mean, look at his eyes. He's as high as a kite. I think he's talking doobies right now. Hey, hey, hey. Don't go laying your head trips on me, you freaky little mutant. What? Hey, 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 he's off, Jack. Did you say something, Anna Nicole? Oh. <sighs> all right. Okay, all right, I don't need this. 
Gill. I'm sequestering myself in my dressing room. I do not wish to be disturbed. Unless, uh, of course, somebody makes a yogurt run. Gil, listen, I could run lines with Rochester if it would help. Dottie, not now. Then when? I will not be dismissed. Later. Okay, thank you. Gil, I'd like to see you right away. Yeah, Allison, I'm right in the middle of, uh... All right, take ten, everybody. Obviously, we know why we're here. Obviously. This can't continue. I'm way ahead of you. So what do we do? About what? <laughs> About firing Rochester. Fire Rochester? What is... He's been with us since show one. What... I know that. <laughs> I know that. I'm as sentimental as the next person, Gil. Trust me, I'm so sentimental. But his, his fur is thinning and his ears are drooping and it's gross. We need to find the next Elmo if we're gonna reach a younger audience. A younger audience? We already reach four-year-olds. How young do you wanna go? Fetal? You know, sometimes we gotta make the tough decisions. Yeah, well, tell that to his 43 kids. Please. Yeah, listen to me, Allison. I am not gonna be a part of this lynch mob. Okay? Because loyalty is my middle name, and I'm not gonna fire the star of my show. Well, if you don't, they're gonna cancel the show. You know, I, I think we're saying the same thing here. Uh, I would never fire Rochester, but I, but I do think that, uh, that he has to be replaced. So, you see, we're quibbling over semantics here, but at least, you know, we're all on the same page. And, uh, hey, great meeting, everybody. Name? Oh, uh, I'm Greg Bunny, and uh, I'm here to interview for an office job with the good people at Sweet Knuckle Junction. Oh, crap. Wow, it's Rochester Rabbit! Oh. God, I hate that guy. Are you all right? Well, <clears throat> rent a cop. Let's just say this was a good day for me not to wear any pants. <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, so, hi there, uh, hi there, Professor Ape. No, oh. no, no. Hi, hi there. I hi, hi there. Popsicle on the counter. Okay. Now all mm. that's left is a sticky puddle. Professor, it's it's so cold, Professor. You uh, <clears throat> you summoned me? Yes, Warren. Uh, we're having a little casting session in here. We're uh, thinking of making a small cast change. You spotty bastard! I give you the best years of my life, and this is how you repay me? Well, the joke's on you, you godless bloodsucker. I am an actor. Mm-hmm, yes, I have range. And I don't need your insipid little moppet show. I just want you to read with the other actors, Warren. We're replacing Rochester. Oh. Well, apparently you do read the suggestion box. Ugh. Jesus, should have got a map. He's gotta be somebody who could... Uh, excuse me, sir, could you tell me how to get to Sweden? Oh, my God! My first celebrity sighting! How you doing, pal? Oh, yeah, excuse me, kid. Oh, man, I can't believe this! I can't believe I'm meeting you! This is the biggest... We need to get this place sprayed. Oh, Count, I am your biggest fan! <laughs> well, no, I'm not the Count from Sesame Street, and I don't know Big Bird, so buzz off. No, 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 of course I know who you are. You're Count Blah, right? Ah, actually, I am Blah. Wow. Count Blah, can I just say that you scare the piss out of me, and I mean that from the heart, sir. Please, you may call me Blah. Blah. Okay, <laughs> Blah, Blah. <laughs> no, just Blah. Blah. Just Blah, Blah. <laughs> blah, my boy, it is simple. Just Blah. Blah. Just blah, blah. Look, don't turn this into a friggin' Abbott and Costello routine, okay? Just call me blah and leave it at that. Oh. Uh. Well, oh. <sighs> well, I just felt like I did, like, not such a good job, you know? I mean, if I can do it again, um, I could be more bear-like. You know what? You did a really terrific job. You were, you were just great. Really. You should feel very good about what you did. Really? There you go. On your way. Jeez, could that bear read more gay? Nope. Um... Uh, hi, Mr. Bender. My name is Greg D. Uh, oh, my God! Professor Ape! <laughs> uh, yes, actually, the name's Warren DeMontague. Okay, real guy standing here, not TV time. 
sorry. It's just that, I mean, I, I love you. I, I've seen everything you've ever done. Godspell, um, Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat. Yes, well, you know, if it was lame and about Jesus, <laughs> I was there. Uh, Gil, you yeah, want to move this along? Right. Hey, Greg, uh, listen, why don't we hear what you can do? Oh, uh, okay, well, uh, I type about, uh, 60 words a minute, and, uh, let's see. Well, I'm a little weary of fax machines ever since I got my ears caught in one once. Uh, I'll spare you those. It's a little traumatic. Was... That's good. Yeah? That's very funny. You're a funny kid. Thanks. One funny bunny. Okay, let's see how you read. Oh, uh, sure. I can, uh, <clears throat> I can read. Uh, let's see. Hi there, Professor Ant. Can you help me figure out what happened to my popsicle? Hey, this is a script from the show. Oh, brilliant. Well, somebody call Harvard, see if they're missing a bunny. Wait a minute. Am I... am I auditioning? Well, you're an actor, aren't you? Uh... Yes. Yes, I am. Yes, an actor. <clears throat> Very talented actor. I act. Uh, I left it on the counter, and now it's all gone, and all that's left is a sticky puddle. Yes, well, that's because it melted. Something anyone would know who's not hideously inbred. Warren? Yep, yep, sorry, sorry, I forgot my glasses. Uh, let's see here, sun heats the earth, blah, 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 32 degrees. Here, feel this ice cube. Ooh, that's so cold, Professor. Ooh, just like the snowball I found. <laughs> Guys, you know what? I love snowballs. Can I just say, I even wrote a song about one once. You want to hear it? No. Snowball, snowball, what do you do with snowfall? You ball it up and make it stick, and then you hurl it like a brick. Snowball, you are my best friend. Snowball, your love never ends. Whether you are white or yellow, you are sure my favorite fellow. Snowball, I'm in love with you. Snowball, you complete me. Snowball, you make me rock my world. You're right, he's cute, he's quick, he does improv, he's like Robin Williams. Yeah, only not as furry. You know, my only concern is that he's got a lot riding on him. I mean, are you sure he's strong enough to carry the whole show? Allison, <laughs> I've been doing this long enough to know a professional when I see one. Okay, I say we hire him. I'll break it down now, snowball, snowball. Okay. But it's your butt if he fails. Good news, Greg. We want you to be on the show. What you talking about, lady? You're gonna be the newest cast member on Sweet Knuckle Junction. Congratulations, Greg. What? Oh, oh my God, well, thank you. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I'm That's so excited. That's just a hug, Greg. <laughs>
What about me? Hmm. Oh, well, you're fired. Hey, buddy. Hey, Jimmy. Did you see what's on TV? What? Not me! I'm sorry! Shit, yeah, just tell me, what part of he's never acted a day in his life did you think was the big selling point? I've said a thousand times, I'm sorry! Yeah, well, you know what I got to say to that? Dude, my dishes are in there. Jimmy, you know how hard it is for me to get a job out there? I am sick of working one day a year on Easter. All right, I screwed up, okay? Yes. I can fix it. Yeah, how? Well, we'll just, we'll go down to the studio and we'll talk to my dad and we will get you rehired. Come on, let's go. What do you think you're gonna say? Oh, don't you worry. I got a plan. Please! No! Now look, I'm shooting a television show in 10 minutes. I need a puppet, a lovable puppet, and get him here fast. Oh, what the hell. Just send over that gay bear. No, Dad, you, you don't need a gay bear. Greg can do it. Jimmy, I really can't deal with you right now. Jimmy, come on, man. All right, I'll tell you what. If, if you hire Greg back, I'll come work for you. Wow, that's a sweet deal. I get not one, but two idiots. Look, I can do it, Mr. Bender, okay? I know I can. Yeah, well, that's a cute sentiment, kid, but you know what? This is cable television. It ain't gonna happen. Gil, did you... <gasps> Greg is here! In the fleece. Gil told me he dropped out to do an Olsen Twins movie. Ooh. What happened with that? Yeah, well, what, what, what happened was that the... the he... Well, Gil here lured us back. Didn't you, Gil? Ooh. Yes, I did. Yes, he did. <laughs> yes, because you know what? You can't let talent like this get away. Right. You should have seen him beg. I mean, it was, it was pathetic. All right, that's enough. The important thing is that Greg is here. Hmm. Hey, don't forget, uh, I'm here too. Yeah, the important thing is that Greg is here. <laughs> hey, you know it. <laughs> what are you doing to me? Oh, like you wouldn't want a piece of that. I've got a show to do in five minutes, and the fate of that show rests on your furry friend's little shoulders. Hmm? If Greggy here can't cut it, if this puppet can't carry the show, Sweet Knuckle Junction will be canceled. Oh, no! It'll be over. Let that sink in. Finished! Now you just go out there and have fun with it. Yeah, but, um... <laughs> you okay in there? It's dark down here, and it stinks. Well, Rachi used to whiz in an old coffee can. Welcome to the Dream Factory. Yeah. Places, everybody. Ready for Greg's intro. You out. Cameras, roll. Ready and action. Uh. Oh, good morning, everyone. Good morning, morning Jack. Jack. Say, Jack, what's wrong with the choo-choo black? Well, I sure don't know. I asked Rochester to oil her up so I could run these pickles to the patch. But, well, <laughs> I guess he forgot. It's not like Rochester. Wherever could he be? <laughs> okay, cut. Holy crap. We're dead. My bosses are, they're watching this on the feed. I gotta get married. <laughs> my, uh, my life is sliding into a big cesspool right now, but uh, I'm gonna keep on smiling because uh, everybody's watching, okay? Smile with me, just smile. Give me a smile. Yeah, that's it. See if you can go over and do something about this. Yeah, I can do that. Now! Don't worry. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> What's the matter? Well, Jimmy, you know, I'm a total fraud. I mean, you heard your dad. If I blow this, they're gonna cancel the show and everyone here is gonna lose their jobs. So don't blow it. That's it? Don't blow it. That's your best shot. <laughs> yeah, wow, not since Vince Lombardi has anyone given such a rousing and inspirational speech. Thanks, Jim. Greg, oh, how hard oh. can this be? Look at your co-star over there. Crayons taste like purple. All right, let's do this let's thing! Let's do this thing! <laughs> okay, all right. Call action. What? Call action. What? Uh... Action! Hi, everybody! Whoa! Who are you? The name's Greg. Greg the Bunny. I just came here to read you a letter from my Uncle Rochester. Well, read it, boy. Read it. Dear everybody, I'm never coming back. Goodbye forever, Rochester. And cut! 
Oh! Sean! Yeah! Hey! Oh! Greg! Hey. That was fantastic. Oh, come on, people. This is the worst written show ever. He is such a natural. Greg, you're fantabulous. <laughs> Top notch, my boy. Uh, thanks a lot, you guys. <laughs> okay, Greg, now we need a close-up of you popping out of your hole. Let's do Greg's close-up. And action! <laughs> Greetings from Funnywood, dirtbags. Roger. What are you doing? I'm gonna cut up the pretty boy. Yeah, let's see how demographically desirable he is with Hold on! No, please, Mr. Rochester, I'm, I'm a bunny. I'm fabricated. I'm one of you, my brother. Shut up. Rochester, my friend, don't do it, Fla. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't. Uh, prison rape. Ah, uh, come on, Rochi, let the kid go. He's not worth it. Just face facts, man. All right? You're not the performer that you used to be. Yeah, that's not what your ex-wife said. <laughs> All right, give me the freaking... Come on, come on, come on, come on. God, you crazy bastard! You want a piece of me, furball? What did you call me? Let's go! Die for me, Jackie! Die for me, Jackie! Kittens and puppies! Kittens and puppies! Oh, oh, I heard you sent for me. Get in! Rochester! You okay? Sure, this place is filled with freaks. I'm gonna fit right in. <laughs> So, puppets and humans may seem different, but you know, in the end, we all want the same things. Love, acceptance, and to luck our way into a cushy job that we really don't deserve. People, please, this does not say pig show! Oh. Hey, Raji, what's going on? Well, they fired me, Warren. What? I... I'm shocked. Apparently, they've been auditioning replacements behind my back. Well, those two-faced kids, uh, you were the show. Yeah, well, they slapped my picture on every lunchbox in America. Now they're hiring themselves some pretty boy and tossing me aside like a dirty sock. Yeah, I'm sorry, I totally drifted off on you.